I consider Super Mario Sunshine to be the black sheep of the 3D Mario games. It's kind of a weird thing that they decided to focus the game on water so much. Something that hasn't changed from Super Mario 64 are the races level. In Mario 64, players had to race against Koopa the Quick, a big turtle. Well, in Mario Sunshine, they raced against El Piantissimo, some dude that claims to be a Pianta, Delfino's island inhabitants, but it is obvious that this guy is just wearing a disguise. Who's hiding under the mask, though? It is never mentioned in Super Mario Sunshine. To figure that out, we have to take a look at the Legend of Zelda series. In Ocarina of Time, there is a runner that runs around in Hyrule Field, and in Majora's Mask, the same runner is the mailman. What does that have to do with El Piantissimo, you might ask? Well, someone imported the 3D model of El Piantissimo in a 3D modeling software and decided to play around with it. He discovered that if the mask was removed, there actually was a face under it. Is that face familiar? Yep, this is the same runner from Ocarina of Time and Majora's Mask. And it all makes sense, because the only time you see El Piantissimo is in race levels. That's pretty neat, huh? What is your favorite video game mind-blowing moment? Share it in the comments section down below and it might get used in a future episode. If you want more VG Mindblow, just click here or there. Thanks for watching.